Alright, so uh, this is going at the beginning of the video. So, um, yeah, hello everyone. I'm here to say that there is uh, another info ranking. Um, so here's the thing, right? The ranking info here is actually not just ranking. There's actually rewards if you're smart enough to think about it, unlike me, and I didn't know. Anyway, the time limit is three days, so it's not like it's, you know, going to be forever there. It's a three-day time limit. I just thought it'd be worth mentioning because, you know, I noticed it at the last moment. I'm trying to also see if I can figure out if that's the other trophy's requirement, too. No, it's just permanent. Okay, so you get one temporarily on the raid boss and the other one's permanent. But anyway, enjoy the rest of the video. Alright everyone, hello, it's Night Dragon. Uh, apparently everything has been released, from what I've seen at least. And instead of doing it on Discord, I'm just going to do it this way because it's easier, now that it's already here. So first off, we have ranking. I don't even know how I got up here. Oh, 40 minutes. I, I don't understand this still. So every moment you're playing the game, you're getting rewards. Alright. Fair enough. Um, let's see. Either that or it's like gameplay damage, like so they can get specific. Also, the the crazy thing about this is I think Wells are gonna benefit the most out of this because free to plays aren't gonna be even able to benefit. See, the Wells, once more, they will get. The best Well will get a hundred attack for a trophy, which is crazy. And then you have um, the Hell Weapon Selection. Now, if you're wondering what this is, it's the Exclusives, which is kind of crazy because you get two of them as you're on first. So um, instead of getting all five top players a chance to get Hell Weapon, they just gave two of them a chance to select what Hell Weapon they want, and the third one is random. So if you have one already maxed out, you're getting probably screwed if you get unlucky. But if you're lucky enough, you'll get benefit out of that. Also, the trophies I'm a little bit against too. Because, like, if you're going to give this one 100, why not get this one um, 80, this one 60, and this one 40, and this one 20. You can still say 20. I feel like it's not, it's mainly this part right here will upset me. There are two 20s. This could have been better. It could have been a 35 at least or something. But, you know, what do I know? The only thing they're really giving benefit to is like two wells in particular here. And everyone else that's free to play isn't going to really benefit out of this. Because we get the crappy stuff here and all the way up to here. Because this right here isn't even exclusive. It's just regular universal. In fact, even if you get fourth or third... You, oh wait, third? Okay, third is alright. But everywhere from fourth downward, it, you get nothing worthwhile for your uh, hard contribution. Hello, everybody. Oh, God, they still have this garbage. Did they even update it? Exclusive. For these legend. Actually, that's the one thing that upsets me about that. They put the legends, legend units that aren't like legend limited, and they don't put their weapon in there. Why don't you put the weapon in there? Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. And then on top of that, you took away the ability to get their weapon exclusive. So now it's like, you don't get that anymore. <sighs> I just hate that. But for the moment, we look like we got the stuff that they'll make money off of to help finish novella, I'm assuming, at this point. Anyway. So as you can see here, we have, we have a spinning wheel. You can do a maximum of 15 if you have that much, like me, or you can do more. Now, I'm only assuming that this will get better over time as you continue to go in it, but I'm not entirely sure either. Let's go ahead and talk about this right here. This is a vault weapon vault breaker, so uh, it's not really that special. But we got 100 gems here, so I don't know what this is still. I'm assuming this... Wait, is this the fight? Is this the boss fight? Are we going to be fighting different bosses? 
What the heck is this? Five dollars? In raid boss one plus daily challenge attempt plus thirty percent attack claim daily pumpkin light times ten light what are you Halloween candy what are you you what what would make this come this come down to pumpkin light and candy wouldn't this be like heavy pumpkin or something? All right, whatever. I don't care. Anyway, we're here to see this, and that means that uh, whoever buys that will get an extra attempt, which is three out of three. I mean, it's five bucks. It's not like it's gonna kill me or anybody that buys it. What well, is it worth it though? Um, here's the thing about that, right? It gives you like ten extra, which is great. It gives you in boss, in raid boss. Plus 30% attack, which is, I don't know how to feel about it. I just feel like that, that's pretty fair, but at the same time, it's not like, I think if they would have went 10% more, it would have been sellable, but I just don't feel it. And then one more boss attempt. So you got to do still a lot of the work, and this isn't going to make you over the top. But if you're a well with a lot of power and trophies in that, you'll make a lot of benefit. And the rewards? Well, the longer we survive against... That, oh, yeah, it is every boss. Okay, so the longer we survive in every one of these bosses, the more rewards we get. So the next one would be this guy, which is the one we're getting for... So I just want to say something that I think JP has a different one. We have the bull, and then we have the sword guy here. I mean, demon. Then we have Beowulf, which JP has. We have sh Shade, Hellshade, which they have this and this. They, d I think they might not have this, or I know they don't have this. I remember to see, and you know, hold up. We're gonna go over to Discord now. Now I gotta go ahead and go over that. Because I did not know that we had different bosses. And I mean, it might be one different, but let's see. Alright, so the first thing I want to say is... Uh, here we are, the proof. Yeah, we do have different bosses. These two are the same. You see Hellshade, you see the uh, Beowulf. But they have Cerberus. And they have, um, what you call it, Phantom. That's at least what it says from the information on their side. Boss bonuses. So, uh, yeah. These two, these four are almost the same. We get two different ones than they do. I don't know why. I am only assuming it's to even the playing field. Because maybe, you know, it might be a little difficult since they're behind us. And they haven't gotten a lot of the new characters out yet. Shut up. I know it's Halloween. This month, at least. And then they have a summon rebate, which um, is great, I'm assuming, for them. Because... Yeah, it gives them Count Thunder. Well, that's a pretty good deal, I guess. I mean, it's not the craziest thing. Oh, yeah, up to here. It's start, start, it giving, at least it's giving 50s and not anything less. So you're getting basically one Count Thunder as you keep going through the... Now, what is in the banner summons? Uh, it's supposed to be these guys. Oh, wait, and this is the candy thing. I don't know why I didn't come here first. This makes my life so much easier. Uh, this is the boss raid thing that we were looking at. This is the roller. And this is the uh, pass. Obviously, you're going to keep going through that path to get more rewards out of the spin. And these are just for the um, things, but doesn't say anything about... Ah, look, we get... Wait, what? Rewards? So, Legend Limiteds are these three. If that's the case, they're going to be a very good after they've done summoning on this event. And these are all the others. Why is there two different ones? Why? I don't understand. Also, if you want to spend money, you have... The They've moved this shit over. There's supposed to be a free slot. Everyone should get, like, one free 
like summon. I mean, not summon, but this thing for free. I mean, it's not going to give you a lot, lot, but it, it still gives you a little bit of gems in that. And I don't understand why they didn't get that in. Anyway, I'll, I'll show y'all on my main. See, it's going to be like that, free. And this is uh, apparently another thing they're selling in the store. Do I recommend it? Never. Because you'll just be better off grinding over time. Unless you want to uh, support the game in that case, then uh, I can't really uh, tell you no or yes. It's up to you if you want to support it. But if you're trying to save yourself money, you don't have to do that. That's not going to make a huge difference. Not unless you have a ton of gems and you're like 10 off from getting the last one that you want of the Count Thunder. Then in that case, yes, you can spend the $10 to get the extra 10 or if you only need like one more, just spend one dollar. Don't get overdo it and get extra. You don't really need to like try to beat these wells. I don't think you can. I don't think anyone could, to be honest. Like to beat the wells, you need to have an a surplus of money, and I know that this game is gonna cost. That's at least from what I've seen. All right, and then it also seems like they start off with Beowulf. But I don't know because I'm not on the Asia server. This is at least what they shown. Three hours ago. I was... <laughs> anyway, this is ours. As you can see here, we do have what we have in the game. So, you know, it is fair. They did inform us of this. Are we happy? Not entirely. This is the summons, which I didn't see it on their side, so I'm kind of confused about that. Like, we have Executioner. Also, you can't test play these units to get the extra gems, which I got a gripe about that, because now all we're getting is 50 out of Executioner. They could at least let us get, like, the 50 out of one of these Vs. But it is what it is. And all the way you get to the 100, you get these things. Which, by the way, these items are very useful because they give you the Legend Limited units. And I don't know if it's only the Vs, but by the looks of it, that's what they're describing. It's giving only Vs. So we're not getting the best um, rewards out of this. I don't think we'll ever... You know what this means... Oh, they have a bunch of exclusive hell weapons out. So there's a total of five of them out. We have Executioner, which he's there. We have the V that's Chromatic, uh, he's there. The uh, Eternal Nightmare V, he's there. And Hellshaker is not there, nor is Count Thunder. But we're getting theirs because I'm assuming they're coming out next. And... Uh, this thing's a waste of time, as always. They have not updated nor changed it. For the 30 bucks you're spending, you could just honestly just genuinely play the game and get that amount. There is no benefit, no freaking time that would be worth spending going into this thing. I would never recommend it, and if you're well, even then, for the love of God, don't give them the benefit of the doubt to get this because I honestly there is literally no benefit it has nothing but the units you could get for free and seeing that the well summon a lot I think they'll be smart enough not to buy this because they can, they can just get whatever character they want from summoning on a banner and getting something new like it doesn't make any sense for us to want this this right here is another thing I didn't get to show it because I was <sighs> I don't, I don't know what to say. I was stunned. Okay, I, I kind of got thrown off track because everything kind of went down when my internet went down. So you know, didn't really get to this part. But uh, this is useful to get a little bit of gems. Nothing too crazy. As long as you do your daily stuff on it, on this, it's gonna have event missions as you can see down here. Just do them, and what you can do, you just do. It's nothing to kill yourself over because it's not that many gems you'll get. It adds up, but it's not as much as you're going to get from, I think, the new event. So, uh, the skin pack will be available later during a Halloween event. Are they talking about Endless Judgments skin that we were promised? Were we... Let me stop. 
<laughs> we're not we're not lied to. Wait, what about Asia? Do they get it before us? So we can at least know what it looks like? No. I thought Asia got some better treatment right there for a sec. I was about to be like, oh, snap. They got the skin already? Well, let's see how good it is. The pat. I'm assuming, you know, here it is. We have it too. Okay, thank goodness. I was about to say. Now, as you can see here, this is why I think the other event is better. Because I didn't know we had this, so I don't know if I could show it on the game. I was going to go back if I didn't. But this right here is very useful because you want to go for these. Don't go for gems because of one reason. I'm going to tell you right now why the gems aren't worth picking up. This is 60. This is 60. You follow me, right? That That's 6 zero. This is 3. Tell me, how many singles can you get out of a 60? You know, I think we all know the answer to this. None. Now, with these, these are singles right here. Sit singles, you want this one because they'll give you sit singles. This will give you three. And I know you might be like, oh, but what if I don't want to go for the V summon thing? By all means, you can go for it. But uh, I would rather go for these because these are more worth my time than this stupid. All right, well, this is 600. That's not even as much as, the, like, look at all of this you're getting. The special breakers are more valuable than the damn gems in this thing. No offense. But, uh, you might not want it. And also, we have... The, why are they still giving this outfit out? If I think it would have been better if they gave out a different outfit. Because that one's so worthless. Because we already gotten it so much. That I think that it's completely not important. I guess if people want to go for that, they can. It's just an outfit. It's like... It's not worth it, in my opinion. Unless you just want to pimp out your V, I guess. But he ain't getting any damage increase out of that outfit. So you can live without it, really, to be honest. This right here is a lot, though. Like, I don't think anyone's going to get to Tier 4. Definitely not getting to Tier 5. Like, despite the fact that I want us to be able to say, Oh, yeah, we're going to make it, baby. Let's go, Tier 5. Even if you go for all gems, you would be lucky to even get in. This is worthless, by the way. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, that's worthless. All right, I was right. And this right here, I still think this is worthless, but for a different reason. This is a legendary unit. Royal Guard. This is a legendary unit. This is Fist Salvation. This is a legendary unit. One Man Show. These three are worthless. You can get them over time. Blazing Tempest you could go for, or Disdain Executioner. Now, I would go for Disdain Executioner because I still think he's amazing. And he was really fun to play. Pier um, uh, what you call it? Blazing Tempest, you would need a Duke in him. And considering you're only getting 50 of these, you're not going to get a Duke. So you'd be better off starting off the um, other ver Dante over this one. Because that Dante, you'll just be stuck in place when you're doing it for a And you don't want that. Now, that's up. We're going to look at the Virgils we're getting here. <laughs> well, that's about right. <laughs> so you get one unit that you basically would be better off going for the summons. If you don't like need any of these units that badly that you're going to go for one Duke. Like, this is just one of them. It's not enough to upgrade them past two tiers. If you want to go for the exclusive weapon, I can't blame you on that either. But, uh, that's if you can get enough, like I said. I don't know. Because, like, from what I've seen, I've always ended up finishing up to tier 3. But not finishing everything on tier 3. Just finishing up to it. Sometimes I get, like, two things in tier 3. It, it just depends on how well and dedicated you are, I guess. But, I don't know. Or if you want to drop some buckarunos and, uh, I don't know where to get this. <laughs> ah, unless you want to drop some buckarunos for, uh, here. Or you can use your gems, I guess, to get more of these, which isn't the worst idea, I guess. I might do it just to see how well it pays me off. And I don't think I would tell you to spend more than... Yeah, that's not worth it. Like, a hundred bucks for this. That's one of the rewards right there. That 1200 That's not worth it. This is not worth it either. They had more. Hmm. This definitely not worth it. Uh, I 
could argue with this one a little bit. I mean, between these two, they look more worth it than the other ones. This one, uh, not really. I don't know. Uh, make this a 50 and make this a 200 and it would have made a better deal for us. Anyway, yeah, so you definitely don't want to do these. Unless you want to do the gems and you just got gems that you saved and you want to go in. I don't have enough. <laughs> God. Well, uh, I guess we're not going to be able to see more than one. I guess I'll have to buy the higher one just to see how far it takes me. How much does it give before I commit to that? 200. That's not bad. And I get 200 gems. No, I could probably buy both. I could probably buy both. You know what? We'll find out. In the, well, I'll find out in the future. Not ya. Yeah, I don't have to worry about this. It's my business that I have to worry. But this right here, this is what I'm assuming they're going to make us do. Like, this is the free one up here. The basic. But for the wells or the players that can actually, not even wells, even the regular player base can benefit off of this. Instead of getting twos and fives, you can get 50 at the start with some gems. Like, honestly, this $10 pack isn't that bad. I would not... I mean, it's a little bit low on the tens here and that, but they got some thirties and some gems in between, which kind of make it worthwhile. I do think that this is actually not that bad. It seems like the best of both worlds. Yeah, you know, that's not bad. This should be a little more, in my opinion, though. Like, this last one is like 300, and I feel like that should be 500. But... You know, it is what it is. It's up to you as you want to buy it, of course. But uh, this one, you start off with eight. Eight. No, that's six. God, it's so hard to see in the dark. It's like really dark on this one. It's 680. So don't think you're getting 800 like I thought. They really didn't do a good job with the number placements with the lining here. I guess it's to trick people into buying it. It might not be. It might just be that they did a shitty job on that. I don't know, but uh, I'm just saying it as I see it. Anyway, with that being said, that's pretty much everything. We're going to go into this real quick, information on the summons, and then we're calling it a day here. It's... <laughs> it's bad. Ah. Yep. Yep. Mm. So, this is a great chance if you're a V fan. <laughs> You know, I can't lie. This is actually the best shot you'll have at getting these legendary units built up. So if you don't have V up and you want like him to be a future useful unit for either of them, I would dare say this is the best shot at it you get. And if you get enough summons in, you are also benefiting off of the summons, I'm pretty sure, for one of the objectives. Like right, right here, right? The rebate. This is the rebate. So even, you don't have to actually go that, wait, how do I, there's only 100, there, there's only one, there's only 100, what, so we can't get, alright, so unfortunately I would not recommend going too deep, I mean it, it is like a really good chance for you to get the V's you want, but here's the thing that I would say, if you get to the 100, don't use the 50, right? If you're going to go in more, use the 50 after you know how everything ended. Because if you're just one character duke away from your character being like busted or something, you're going to want that 50 to have the option to make him better. I would never recommend using this off the bat. And this is a great chance for me because I actually do want my V. But the problem is I also wanted to stay in Executioner to get up too, but... I don't think I'm going to be able to get enough gems to get him and them. So I might end up, you know, uh, you know, that's for later, whenever I come across to that road. Right now, I don't have enough, so you won't see the summons until later. But, like, I don't know how much later it will take. It just takes time. Just know that I'm working on it as we speak. Anyway, with that being said, that is everything that they had to cover in this game. Did we get Endless Judgment skin? No, we did not. I'm going to check just for the hell of it. Yeah, we didn't. So anyway, we didn't get the skin yet, but they did say that. And it's okay because I'm, I'm hoping that the skin's going to look actually good. You know, really cool. 
So, uh, you know, as long as it looks, like, really nice and that, I'm okay with the weight. But if it's really going to be, like, a half-baked work-off on it, I'm going to be a little upset. Anyway, with that being said, just do your um, stuff in the game. Just know that you got to do this. You got to do the special raid. You got to do these spins to get, like, free rewards. I don't know how many gems these are because they don't have a number. If it's one, then that's an incriminating number because this ain't... Like, there's no amount of money that's worth. Like, if a whale is going in this, you know, I'm going to tell you right now. We're going to find out. I actually hate this thing. There we go. How much is that? 20? Oh, man, that's not even one. What was this one, then? If that's 20, then, you know, let's just see what happens for the next one. All right, let's just entertain the idea and just say it's more than this one. <laughs> I don't want to deal with it anymore. Is there a reward thing where I can see the rewards? I would love to know how much you're getting out of this one. It might just be 20 more than this one, but I don't know. I haven't played this nearly enough. But if I find the answer out, I'll tell you in the summon. Just know that this isn't worth welling on, in my opinion, unless you want the... Unless you know that you're going to beat everyone in the ranking reward, because you're getting 100 attack. Like, that's not something to joke about. And you get two exclusive... Uh, exclusive? Exclusive? Uh, exclusive weapons and you also get a hundred of these which you can upgrade a unit twice with I say that this for whales is gonna be game-changing for me not so much I'm a free to play I hate you that's it all right I quit <laughs> I'll just tell y'all when I get the answer or maybe I'll show a video of me doing it very shortly when I'm doing a whole bunch of these I'll see you on the next one bye